Hi everyone, welcome to my YouTube channel. In today's episode, I will show you how we can change our scene uh, in Unity and I will show you three methods using which we can load our scene. So first of all, I have made a panel and I have created a button on it. Using this button, we will go to our second scene. Currently, uh, we are in scene A. We have two scenes. Uh, the name of this scene is scene A and we will move to scene B from scene A using this button. Okay so double click on scene b to see how it looks so this is scene b and and this is scene a now first of all we will have to add our scene a to the build index how we will do that go to file build settings and click on add open scene so our build number is zero for scene a after that uh, save it using Control plus s and now go to scene b double click on it to open it and also add this one to the building index go to file build settings and click on add open scene now both of our scenes are added to the build settings so the build number of scene a is zero and the build number of scene b is one now close it save it and go back to scene a now we will write the code to change the scene first of all we have a script I have created a new script and I have renamed it to change scene. I will drag and drop this change scene script to any of the game object. Either you can create a new game object or you can add it to an existing game object. Let me create a new game object and rename it to scene manager. We can reset its transform but we don't need it. Now drag and drop this change scene script to this scene manager game object and double click on it to open it in the visual studio first of all at the top of the script you must add using unity engine management if you want to change your scene after that we will create a new method you can name this method anything you want i have named it load new scene so there are three ways to load a scene in unity uh, the main line that we use in all three methods that is same is scene manager dot load scene all three methods are using this line and after that the things are a bit different so in the first in the first method we must write the name of the scene for example if we want to change our scene from scene a to scene b we will write the name of scene a so it will be like scene b make sure this name here is exactly same as that of your scene name after that, there is a second method that we can use to load our scene and that is by using the build number on, or the scene number. So I will remove this as the build number of our scene B is 1. You can check this one here. Go to file, build settings and you can see the scene B has the build index of 1. So we will add the build index 1 here. We can load our scene using either the scene name or the scene build index. The third method is not used to load a different scene. Instead, in this method, we load the current scene or the existing scene. For example, if you want to reload your existing scene, you will use this method. So what we will write inside this method, scene manager dot get active scene dot build index. You don't have to write anything else. Just write this line and it will load your current scene. So for now, I will be using only the first method. So comment the other two ones. Save this and go back to Unity. Wait for it to load. Now we will click on our button. This is the button that we will use to switch our scene. Now on this button, click on this plus sign. Drag and drop the scene manager game object. And from here, look for change scene and look for a method named load new scene. So this is calling our load new scene method. Now enter play mode to test. And just like that, we are able to change our scene. So this was how we can change our scene in Unity. If you enjoyed the video, give it a thumbs up and let us know in the comments what would you like to see next. And make sure to hit the subscribe button and press the bell icon. We will see you in the next video. Goodbye.